Hey y'all, it's Leslie, and I'm here with a uh, share uh, from a Christmas gift. It's um, just just a little thank you, I guess, um, from a friend. It's one of the creators on YouTube. Her name is Lisa Fisher, and I will link to her channel below. She sent me some goodies, and I want you to see everything she sent. Let me make sure it's all out here. Okay. Okay, so... Um, she sent some fabric pieces and some other goodies, which I flipped out for, but look at this, this velvet, isn't that so cool? I, Lisa uses fabric like this in so many cool ways in her journals, and so I... <laughs> I don't know if you guys do this, but when you are watching somebody with the, go through their junk journals and flip through and show how they did everything, I'm taking notes, and, and Lisa has such great ideas. She uses these as pockets on the edge and things, so I'm excited to try and, and figure out some cool things to do with this. It is a, it's a, a pretty thick um, upholstery type velvet feel. Then here is one that was probably more of a um, you can see, I don't know if you can see, but yes, you can see my hand through there just a little bit. And, um, this is probably more of an, uh, clothing, um, sort, but it has that velvety feel. Again, another piece of thicker velvet. Um, it doesn't have one of those, you know, brush it this way and brush it that way sort of things, but it's probably more in the upholstery arena or a very thick velvet for curtains this one I love the color of it it's just a, a peachy pink maybe you could call it um, a salmon color and it has it's the same velvety um, feeling and I just it's gorgeous it's gorgeous so vintage looking that color and then look at this cool piece she sent look at this you see that? It has this design on it, and it's like it's bedazzled. All these little bitty, tiny, tiny, tiny sequins, and it's not really sequins. It's just little, little beads, iridescent beads. Look at that. Isn't that cool? I'll lay it down so you can see the whole thing. Yeah. So she sent that as well. So all these fabrics, and then she sent some flashcards. And beautiful napkin, beautiful napkins. I mean, I love napkins because you can do so many different things with them. Just little pieces of them and mod podge it to a paper and it's just beautiful. Look at that. It's gorgeous. Thank you so much. Look at that. Look at this one. This is beautiful too with the butterflies and the flowers. Exquisite. Very vintage looking as well. And she sent, um, here's a, another little tag shape. Um, these are so cool. I, I didn't, I don't really understand them other than to say that probably this is Italian. And it has to be, yeah, Tuscany. So it has to be um, flashcards about locations. And so, Pienza, uh, and then you have the information about that and where to go. It's sort of, um, it says, don't miss the thingy and, and all that. So, the entire town can be walked in less than an hour, and chances are you'll want to do it again after a break for coffee or gelato. So it seems like they're kind of travel advertisement sort of flashcards, but I love them. Um, first of all, because they're Italian. Um, I have Italian heritage in my family, and so that was super cool. But then also because they are just very unique. I've never seen anything like this. So I love those, Lisa, and you need to tell me where you found them. Here's some cork uh, ribbon. It feels like, I don't know if you can tell on the back. Let me get close enough. Yes. You can see that it sort of has a muslin sort of uh, fabric lining to it. But yet it is cork. It feels like cork on this side. It's very, very thin. 
I think you can see my fingers underneath. Yes, we're, see right there? Um, but she sent me a couple of pieces of that. Love that stuff too. That's super, super cool. Then she sent, look at this. She sent me a die. And isn't this gorgeous? Look, the flowers kind of stick up a little bit. You can cut just the outside um, section. You can cut just the center section or you can cut just the middle. And look, you can get it in different colors and things. Isn't that gorgeous? And it's Spellbinders. Let's see. What's the name of it? Um, no, oh. Spellbinders, Spellbinders Labels 46 Decorative Elements. And there's three pieces. And this is the sizes. But isn't that beautiful? There's the number of it if you wanted to look it up. Woo! There's the number of it if you wanted to look it up. And it's just so pretty. Can't wait to use this. Hers are so cool. Okay, and then look at this. She sent me a stamp set. And oh my gosh, this is so cool because these can be used. You stamp them in distress ink or you can stamp them using coffee um, or anything and use them to make your own little ephemera. But it's not just a stamp set. What is it? There's a stencil also, and look at this cool design. I do not have a stencil with this design. So that's super cool too. So yes, I'm, I'm very excited, Lisa. This is just um, above and beyond, but I think you're going to like the box, um, the bag of goodies that I send back to you. I, I was thinking about using the same envelope and just kind of sending it back to her, but one of the goodies I got her I don't think is going to fit in here. So, that means a bigger box for you. And if it's a bigger box, it's got to have more goodies in it to make sure it fits. So, I will see you all very soon. I've got so much um, goodies to show you guys. Uh, this, is, this is the stuff from the haul from Christmas. But I got a few things uh, before Christmas uh, from a lady who was selling out her fabric uh, supplies. And she had lace and trims and things. And I, I got some things from her. I bought a little bit because it was like 15 cents and 10 cents a yard. And she sent me way more than I asked for. <laughs> so, um, yes, I'll be sharing that quite a lot with everybody. Lisa, be prepared. You want to get some goody fabrics right back. So, thank you all for stopping by. And please like, share, and subscribe. Bye. Oh, shoot. I'm not people in the head. Turn off. Off. <laughs> Aloha Mora. <laughs> Shoot.